I have a little project that I picked up today and it's basically making a lining for these two bins. Essentially, these are Josh's new laundry bins. They're not really for laundry. It's more for like storage or maybe even a trash. No, I don't think it's a trash bin, but it's more for storage. And the only issue in terms of like living with this kind of product is that the laundry machine is actually like in the basement down here, but then these are actually going to be on the second floor of the house. <laughs> I suggested an idea where I can make the lining and then that way when Josh needs to do his laundry, he can just remove this cap, pick up the laundry with the lining and just bring them downstairs to the basement so that's a lot easier. There's a smaller one and a bigger one for its whites and its colors. The material, ta -da! it's cute because it has this like grid system on it. I don't know. It's like waffer. Waffle. This is the only fabric left. So if I screw up, there is no more of this fabric. So I cannot screw up. You cannot screw up. You're not gonna comfort me? You can't screw it up. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm doing this for you! I don't know how much I'm gonna get done today, realistically. My goal is to get the shapes down and hopefully cut it. I was also gonna ask you if you wanted to play. Oh, chinta? Yeah. <gasps> so that you could do this at tomorrow's work time. <gasps> you're right. Yeah. Let's play. We'll continue this tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I'm gonna play today. <laughs> I'll do this tomorrow. Yay! Kachi <laughs> Yay! It really is the next day. So my plan for right now is to kind of have these like basically trace the shape of them and just like finesse it until it's like really clean and easy and then just go from there. Change my mind. I'm going to use this mesh and outline the inside of it because the outside has so many like little extra shapes and all I need is the inside. very unfortunate update is I made it too small <laughs> I think it took me like five hours to make the small piece not even a large one so I'm just gonna run it through a laundry test to see how it reacts after going through our laundry and then just figure it out from there It's a new day, by the way. I couldn't... Literally, after doing this yesterday and realizing that it was smaller, I just kind of like melted away. So I just had to stop. But today, I don't really have that much determination, but I do have the desire to make my husband happy. So I'm going to make the small one again. I don't know if I have enough fabric for the big one, but I don't know. Well, whatever, man. Let's just... Back in Joann's because so the fabric that we bought last time we actually ran out because I messed up so no. so we're back here to buy 
a different type of fabric and hopefully there'll be no more mistakes and we don't have to come back here until a really really long time found this linen fabric yeah it seems to do the trick oh it's very it feels very oh oh yeah oh let's not do that in front of me <laughs> what can i cut for you can i get two yards of this got the fabric i'm not gonna bore you with the same clip the same vibe i actually already cut out from the old fabric as like a template hopefully this will fit or maybe even be bigger it's also completely fine She finished the laundry train. Ta -ta. And now she's cutting all the threads. It's like tiny threads. It's like kind of ugly. No, it's beautiful. It's beautiful, babe. Like, you can see it's not even a square on the inside. Oh, it's just a tiny now. That's fine. Good. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Wow! Wow! That's my new laundry bag! <laughs> no, that's really? the brand. What? Really? You know how like the snapbacks you always put on the tags? It's like that! <laughs> but that's ugly too! And? Oh, that's right. I'll keep that. No worries. Okay. Yay! Yeah, thank you. You're welcome! <laughs> oh my god! Do you like it? Oh, it's nice. It's much better. It is nice. Yay! Wow, so good. So thank you. Do you like it? I like it. Yay! Come Hi, come here. Or cheer, 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 cheer. Good girl, man. Good girl. You're being so good. We have to go to the vet today. Should I give it to you like this? Yes. I go. Calming music? Yeah. <laughs> calming music. Maybe it is working. We're going to the vet because she needs to get some dental cleaning and a tooth extraction. Sad. It just has to be done. She like literally, she has like a cavity and it's painful for her so she has to get it removed. I've recently started really taking care of her teeth so I'm just hoping that this is kind of like a good cleanse and then just take care of it from there so that there, she doesn't need to go through this again because clearly she loves it. It's like 8 a.m. We need to drop her off and pick her up a little bit later. So we'll see how she is afterwards. This is my first time doing this. I have no idea what to do or like what to expect. Good girl of me. I'm so sad! Oh, 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 is all right. okay. Shall we get Starbucks now? Mm. Let me tell you how much her vet bill is because oh, I did not think this would be this expensive. So I have paid only the higher half for the deposit and for the deposit itself it's nine hundred and eighty six dollars 
I don't really know how much it's gonna cost. It's because depending on what they find during the procedure of cleaning your teeth, you know, like something could happen that could increase the price. Maybe it's not just one cavity. Maybe she actually has two cavities that we didn't see when she was just getting her checkup. So, oh my goodness. And you know what else? makes today so busy i have an interview <laughs> in two hours so i just need a i need a prep and then you get ready professional <laughs> that one okay we'll see if i hear back oh it's 5 p.m now they called me letting me know that the surgery went well and to pick her up at five today and i was like oh okay and she was like yeah the extractions were great like everything seems fine and i was like extraction because i thought it was going to be one extraction and that was like a cavity and that's all i knew but then they told me that they took out 10 of her teeth and that was like 10 for some reason i thought cats only had like 12 teeth so i was like so she has no teeth like what the freak but apparently cats have 30 teeth so i guess she's okay i'm just i was shocked for i think two hours they extracted 10 of her little teeth like do i keep them oh do i, I pay for them to get extracted right i guess so that'd be crazy but they're cavity teeth you know cool buddy when parents like keep the baby's baby's teeth when they come out <laughs> hi baby ah! oh ah! you've been such a good girl ah! ume ume ah! hi ah! Oh. Yeah, actually we we have our teeth do you want to keep them you don't have can to. i see it yeah you can see them oh it's just one it's a couple of them oh my god How oh my you can keep there? them if you want you don't have to <laughs> no it's okay okay all right <laughs> thank, thank you of course so be careful so cute it's like falling Oh my gosh. Maybe it's tricky on here. Oh my god, oh my god. Your sister is. Take a page. Oh, 